Fournette. Fournette goes airborne. He's in. Touchdown, Jaguars. Tip and intercepted by Ramsey to close it out. It's over. The Jacksonville Jaguars have pulled off the upset of the playoffs. The year 2018 as well, that has been hard for me, but has also been good for me in some different ways, is also over. And I could say, thank God for that, and let's bring in 2019. Now, I have a lot of people asking me, what's next for Troop Talks? Do you intend to be here next year? Are you going to make any off-season videos? What is your ideas, Tree from Troop Talks? Because we are loyal, and we want to know what you're doing, and hey, I appreciate that. But, what I'm going to say might surprise you. So, ladies and gentlemen, let's dive into it. So, this is What's Next from Troop Talks. You know, when I first came back to YouTube, my whole entire focus was about the Jacksonville Jaguars because that's what I used to make YouTube videos on. That's what I knew. That's what I loved. And that's what this channel was all going to be about. And so far, ladies and gentlemen, you guys have built this channel up really really incredibly like i cannot be more thankful for those of you that come through the streams that watch the videos like the videos comment on them and subscribe we're currently at i believe 645 subscribers i could be wrong that could be over the estimate but either way i'm around 640 subscribers uh, i started this back up in maine and to gain that many subscribers in december is completely and utterly unreal and now I know that I have potential to really do this YouTube thing. There's just little things in my game that I need to cork. For example, I need a new camera, I need a new microphone, the editing software, all the like little tiny critiques that go on behind the scenes that no one really likes to do, I need to start doing. And I'm taking responsibility for that and we're going to be starting that up for next year and for more projects to come as well. Um, as for the offseason, your boy is going to be making videos. Uh, I'm going to be doing draft profiles. I'm going to be doing uh, free agency previews. You know, basically the exact same shit I did uh, in the offseason this year is I'm going to be doing in the offseason this year. I'm also going to be diving into training camp once training camp comes around, doing the reaction review and news. Like, that's not going to change. We're still going to do that. Uh, this still will be a Jacksonville Jaguar channel. So you can get all your Jaguar news, you can get all your Jaguar takes, like you can get all of that. That's still going to be a part of the channel, but I'm going to start adding layers to the channel as well. Now the NFL picks are still going on, uh, me and Brelge, me and Bridge, me and Bryce, whatever you want to call him, uh, my best friend of 15 years. You know, um, we're still going to be doing picks up until the Super Bowl. So we will be picking the playoff matchups this week um, and, you know, going forward doing that as well. But once the NFL season is over, we are going to be diving into more of a podcast format. We're not really sure 100% what the podcast is going to be called or what the podcast is going to 100% be about just yet. But that's going to be a con that's going to be a day and that's going to be a day of content um, as well on the channel. And, you know, I have a big goal in mind that I want to start a series that is basically going to be kind of like a newscast, but it's going to be spun away in my own way. And I have a lot of people that are in on it, and I have a lot of people that um, I know would love to help and would love to uh, get that show on the road um, as far as video editors go, you know, people that want to work it on social media, camera people, all of that. Like, I'm trying to build a whole squad because I think this idea can really take over the YouTube channel and really, you know, take me to the next step as far as getting partnered on this website goes. So that's really the big work in progress. I wouldn't expect any of that to show up until around April. Um, I'm teasing it right now because I'm really excited about it and I really want to start getting working on it. Uh, it's in the brainstorming phases right now. And uh, I've already talked to some people and uh, they're all about it, they're ready to go. They j j it just takes like little tweaks, you know. When you're being creative and you're trying to think of your own, um, I guess, platform or your own series, you know, it's kind of like your baby, you know. You don't want to mess it up. You want to make sure that it's 100% ready to go and it's 100% what you want it to be. And that is what I'm doing for this whole new idea that I'm trying to build for the channel. But something else that's exciting that I would like to announce for you guys is that the American Football Alliance, or um, 
Football America, you know, it's something like that. Um, that started off after the Super Bowl, and your boy is going to be covering that because your boy just loves himself some football and can't get enough of it. Ah, peach tea today instead of coffee. That's a good one. This, one, this might as well be a story time with Trev, honestly, but... Um, <clears throat> we're going to be covering the AAF. It starts a week after the Super Bowl, and the team that I will be covering is the Salt Lake Stallions. I was born in Layton, Utah, which is right down the way from Salt Lake City, so I decided that would make the most sense for me to cover, also because there's a lot of, uh, you know, Pacific Northwest guys, which is where I'm from, that are on the team as well, so, you know, you gotta love that, you gotta love to see that. Uh, BJ Daniels is their quarterback. Um, you'll probably remember him if you're a Seahawks fan. And yeah, you know, more football on the way. So a, regular, a whole regular season to do for the Salt Lake City Stallions. And I think that they have a nine-game regular season. It can't be an odd number, can it? It's like a ten-game regular season, I think, uh, for Salt Lake City. And I'm going to be doing preview videos for them coming up really, really soon, like probably this week. Uh, going over their roster and going over uh, other teams as well, what I project them to do, so on and so forth. That starts after the Super Bowl. So, you know, I cannot wait for that. I cannot wait to give you more football content, probably bring in a whole new legion of fans, and I can't wait to see where Treve Talks goes in 2019, and you guys better buckle up for the ride. And that was what's next for Treve Talks. What did you guys think? Leave your comments down below. Don't forget to check the links down below as well. Don't forget to like me on Facebook at Treve Talks. Follow me on Twitter at Trevon Pixley or follow me on Instagram at Trevon Pixley. Also, if you're feeling oh so generous, you can go ahead and donate on Patreon. That's patreon.com forward slash Treve Talks. Also, if you haven't yet, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Click the bell icon so you get notified every single time I drop a new video. I drop new content on this channel six days a week. Ain't nobody outworking me. Them just straight facts. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. And as always, you guys have a great day.